All right, here he is, the number one lightweight contender, making his way to the octagon and looking to leave as the new undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world. He has bided his time, waiting for this title shot. He's got the winning streak. He has the quality of opposition. Now he's fighting the number one guy in the world. He believes he's the best. Now his opportunity to prove it just a few minutes away. As he makes his way towards his cage, he believes this is his time. He believes he is destined to take this title. His preparation for this bout has gone absolutely according to plan. He's in fantastic shape with a great game plan, and he expects to walk out of his cage tonight as the new champion. Well, in a division as talented as 155 pounds, it is absolutely remarkable what this man has accomplished. Here he is, folks, the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world. Now, his goals, far more lofty than that. The title defenses are starting to pile up, but he believes with this type of challenger that has some momentum with fight fans, if he can dust this guy here tonight, he can take his career to the next level and start to be mentioned with the GOATs, the Hall of Fame types. For now, he'll have to settle for UFC lightweight champion. We will see how it goes for him tonight in Vegas. The champion headed to the cage right now is in the groove. He is in his prime right now. His training for this bout has been perfect. He believes he has a solid game plan and he's ready to step in here and retain his title. He is well prepared for this contest. And now our tail of the tape for this lightweight scrap. More than five years apart and they have the same height and reach. To get us started with the official introductions, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon is Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Bell Center in Montreal. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Lightweight Championship of the World! Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner! This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 6 inches tall, weighing in at 136 pounds. Fighting! Out of Manila, Philippines, introducing the challenger, the Lion. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet six inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Manila, Philippines, ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending. Champion of the world, Monster! All right, this is for the championship. You've been given your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. They touch gloves and we are underweight. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, here we go. Will we crown a new UFC lightweight champion here tonight? It is time to find out. Oh, power kick to the arms. Oh, body kick attempt here. It's no good. Oh, that was a big left hand he connected with. Oh, very nice. Oh, what a leg kick. Oh, left hook to the head, it's blocked. Got clip with the right hand. Again, Joe circling to his right here, trying to avoid those big shots coming back. 
There's the kick, it's blocked. Push kick there to the body. Really missed with that right hand. Working on a single leg here. Oh, and he caught the kick. Well, takedown defense has been on point tonight. He leaned on it once again there. Nice job to stuff that shot. Good shot. High kick, very nice high kick. Good combination so far from both men. Hit him hard with that hook. There, Joe. Big body shot, shot to body. And now trying to take the back. Nice, very nicely done. Into the final minute now of this championship fight. 45 seconds remain in the round. And he switches his stance yet again. This lands a glancing right hand upstairs. Oh, he landed an uppercut. uppercut. That will not feel good tomorrow. Final seconds here of round one. Horn sounds for the end of round one. And that's what started everything off, that beautiful jab. And here's another punch that sneaks through. And here's another perfectly placed punch. We really got a chance to see some awesome action in that round. Carly Baker in the building tonight. Thank you very much. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, round two. All right, so here we go with round two. We'll see. Whoa! for the tap. Well, yeah, so the work in the gym pays off here tonight as he gets the win by submission. Gorgeous setup on the choke, and I think even better execution down the stretch. Clearly, it was sunk in deep. His opponent had no choice but to tap or take a nap. In this case, he chose to tap out. And here we can see it again. That's a real tight choke here. And here we see it again. Beautiful submission victory. Well, ladies and gentlemen, there he is, the UFC lightweight champion, and I'm not sure any 155-pounder could have held up under the onslaught here tonight. He wins the belt by way of submission. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's called a stop to this contest at 58 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by tap out. The new king of the 155 pounders, and you are looking at him, the undisputed lightweight champion. And it's one thing to come in and beat the champion, it's another thing to come in and submit him. So, really, an incredible result here tonight that we are still digesting, Joe. And as they celebrate in the corner, it's going to be very interesting to see who this fighter takes on next in the first defense of his 155 pound title.